Aces are like adverse childhood experiences and pretty much what that means is just experiences that happen when you were a young person that could affect you like as life goes on. Thank you for seeing me today, taking the time out of your day to talk to me. Uh, crazy like my mom my dad they just they just keep on fighting I don't, I don't know what to do they're always yelling always cussing not like nothing's ever nothing's ever in like a happy good mood in my house honestly i just need some advice because my mom she's started to use again she's gone back into drugs and my dad well he just spends most of his time at the bar doing his own thing just drinking his life away and i mean just bad things have been going on with her. My mother's health, she can barely talk without falling asleep. And works barely any hours. Well, I appreciate you confiding in me for right now. And I think our next step would be to talk some more, see what else you're going through, and also to make sure that you have other people that you can turn to in case of emergency. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Hi, good day. In my life, I've been up and down nowadays, and I, I, I'm trying just to give up. I don't know why, but... Yeah. What's what's been going on? My dad comes home calling me awake, worthless and insulting me. And sometimes mom just being get insulted and beaten up, so she relieves her anger on me by beating me up and insulting me too and that affects me too much. Um, lately in my house it's been pretty bad. Life's not going so good. School, family, friends. Not sure what to do. Tell me more. What's been going on? Uh, my dad's been like in and out of prison all my life, and now he's got sentenced to 25 to life. And me and my mom, my mom can't support us, so we're probably gonna get evicted soon. So I have nowhere to stay, and my friend's house aren't like the most ideal thing. I don't want to interrupt with like what they have going on with their life. That's a lot of heavy stuff. Um, first of all, I want to say, like, great job just by talking to someone about it. So thank you for coming to me and sharing this information. Trauma is a wound. It's something that happens in your life that is bad, but it's not the end of it, everything. You can still be resilient and get over that. Trauma is like injury or damage that's caused to a living organism, maybe like a wound. It can be physical or it can be external or internal damage that's caused to someone. Trauma is a wound. It can be either emotional or physical or mental and it's like where it's like where something that can happen to you where it can either leave a scar that'll last for either your whole life or if you find a way to like like you know heal heal the wound then it's not a problem to you. Resilience is the ability to overcome hardship in your life. If you went through in your lifetime went through really difficult situations. Resilience is the thing that allowed you to just get up in the morning or just like, you know, take that first step to find your purpose in life. Resilience is your own self-worth. It's what you do to help you overcome the obstacle that's in your way. It's either in life 
or figuratively? Resilience is overcoming or to recover quickly from difficulties or toughness, just like rising from the ashes. Examples of resilience could be like finding something that you love to do to like take your mind off of all the bad things that are going in your life. There's options like Team Blink. Uh, they're able to text you or just call whenever you need it. If you like need somebody to talk to personally about the issue going through in life or just something that like you just need like talking with, the number is one eight six six Team Blink. Teen health centers are play places in your schools where you can go. It's totally free. A charge as long as you're a student. They can like give you uh, checkups, like you need a therapist or someone to just talk to. They're always there for you. ACES stands for Adverse Childhood Experiences. Events that happen when you're a kid that can impact your health later on. Examples include physical, sexual, or emotional abuse, neglect, parental separation or divorce, or a family member going to jail. To learn more about ACES and whether they may be impacting your life, visit acestudy.org. We are a group of Seattle youth focused on promoting mental health and suicide prevention amongst our peers.